All right, y'all, before we get into this video, talk about pre-workout, hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, hit the notification bell. I'm going to show you how to get energy to push real heavy, hard weight, you know what I'm saying? All right, y'all, we pulling up at the vitamin shop at Anderson, South Carolina. I'm going there and get some pre-workout and possibly going on a supplement shopping tour. And if I just get the pre-workout, um, yeah. See, that's how much pre-workout I got left. Um, I got other pre-workouts at home. I got the Equate, and I got some other stuff that's weak that I don't really take. You know what I'm saying? The Equate I could take. But, you know, I'm to the point in my diet where I got to go hard, so I need the good stuff. You know what I'm saying? And I might, you might be new to pre-workout. If you're new to pre-workout, this might be a scoop and a half. This is perfect for me. You know what I'm saying? If you brand new to pre-workout, if you're taking something like this, Mr. Hyde Extreme, this is some very extreme pre-workout. I would I would advise you to take a half a scoop, not even a whole scoop. A half a scoop, yes. Um, but I'm gonna show y'all tomorrow. If y'all don't want to wait until tomorrow, go look at my other supplement videos that I got already up. Pretty much the same thing. Um, I'm gonna show you how I buy pre-workout. So my number one pre-workout, whenever I'm broke, or trying to save money, the number one pre-workout that I will take is the Equate. This right here, it works almost just as good as the ones I be taking when I got bread, or I ain't, don't care about bread. I care about bread, but I'm just saying like, this works just as good. Not as good, but just as, and it's a monthly supply. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what I mean? I ain't heard nobody say that in a long time. I'm bringing that back. I we'll have this six star, which I will not take. I ain't gonna give it away because I've been like um, scooping it. You know what I'm saying? Taking it to the head. And when somebody takes it, I never. I always advise never take nobody pre workout anything they scoop because they take it to the head. It will touch your mouth and that's nasty. Somebody can have something and pass it on to you. You got to think about that. And it ain't just the stuff that's going on now. That does not mean everything else. This has never been. No, it has been open. Still, this is a full thing of pre-workout, and I won't take it because it's trash. But yeah, man, any y'all seen yesterday, I ran out of pre-workout, so you know what I'm saying I'm gonna go in there to get some pre-workout. But if I see some supplements on sale, I'm gonna get some of those two different ones. But if not, I just take y'all to the crib with me and show y'all that. All right, y'all, I'm going to show y'all how I do. This is one of my go-tos. It's on sale for 46 bucks. I look at everything that's on sale, and I go from there. This is Woke AF, um, bucked up, you know what I'm saying? This right here, buy one, get one, 50% off, pro subs, Mr. High, you know what I'm saying? So that's my main go-to out of everything. You got the pumping, you got the extreme, you know what I'm saying? Um, you also got uh, um, other things up there, but... That's not on my radar. Nitroflex, very good. Um, it's not on sale. B Nox. I used to take this back in the days. It used to be called Bull Nox. That's what the B stand for. I don't know how good it is nowadays. Total War. That's trash in my opinion. Um, it's on sale though. But you know why get that when the same price? I'm getting the stuff that I like. You know what I'm saying? So C4 also trash and it's high. Nope. Um, this Endo Explode. This used to be the best pre-workout back in the days. I don't know how it is now. I haven't tried it in a long time, but it's super high. Um, Outlift, that's real good stuff. The Animal, that's cool too. High and the scoop is big. I like to take mine to the head. Scoop too big. I have to mix it. Um, Ultimate C4 Shreds. Fat burners in pre-workout. I don't really believe in fat burners. Um, a lot of people do, but then again, you got to think about it. If you start working out and eating better or eating less calories, also Flashpoint, this is on the Body Tech Vitamin uh, Shop brand. I've never tried it, but it's a good price. But if I'm going to get something cheap, I'm going to go with Equate from Walmart. You know what I'm saying? Hey, it's 10 bucks, and it's almost as good as some of this good stuff. This right here, I don't know if this is good or not, but it's 22 bucks, Not a bad price. You know what I'm saying? Then you got this right here, Dimatize Nutrition. Buy one, get one. But I ain't never took that either. Muscle tag, I don't think that's, I don't know. This right here, I ain't never seen a um, bottle like this. This is one pack, but this both are pre-workout. So I ended up going with the um, 
going with what I know. I got the uh, pump, thermo, and I got the extreme. All right, y'all. I'm kind of pumped up for what I actually got. Um, this was buy one, get one half off. And that's a good sale. I would have got the bucked up one, but then it was just two. Um, those are both the same thing, just different flavor. These are not the same exact thing. This is high and that's high. Mr. Hyde Extreme. This is an intense pre-workout. This is stimulant. This is high stimulant. This right here is stimulant free. This is the pumping pre-workout. You know what I'm saying? They're made, I think they're made to stack together. Don't quote me on that. But I usually take about a scoop and a half of this, which you know I would recommend if you brand new to take a pre-workout to not even take a full scoop. I would say a half a scoop. See where you're at. Don't need to take a full scoop. Yes, you it, overdoing any pre-workout or energy drink or whatever is dangerous. You know what I'm saying? This is my go-to. This is my number one go-to pre-workout. It's been for years. Um, but I haven't tried their pumping um, pre-workout. And the main ingredient in a pump pre-workout is this right here. L-citrulline. And you know I'm doing my physique update this weekend. So getting a good pump is very important for the way you look. You know what I'm saying? Now, if you got a higher body fat percentage, in my opinion, higher body fat percentage, I'm really lean right now. My abs are showing, whatever. Um, a pump is very important for me. Pump is for showing off. Well, pump does help a little bit when it comes to muscle building, in my opinion. But getting a pump from actually working out you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, like I said, I'm going to show y'all the supplements that I have at home and what I take and why uh, when I get home. But, uh, yeah, man, they didn't have too much on sale. Oh, I forgot. Always supposed to go in there and ask. It's too late. Now I ain't going back in there. But um, I'm still there, by the way. Um, but uh, I usually ask for, like, if y'all got any samples. I don't care. Oh, you freeloaded. No, I'm not. I just spend money with y'all. You know what I'm saying? They don't be thinking that, but cool, man. Hey, man, I had great conversations with the um, people in there. I told them to follow my channel. They said they will. So, if y'all watching this video, salute to y'all. You know what I'm saying? But, um, yeah. No matter what you take, man, you see what that says? It said earn it. No matter what you take, you have to earn it. A lot of people take fat burners. And they think it's working. But then you change up your diet. Then you start working out. If you was doing nothing, now you're doing something. Mm. Are you sure it's the fat burner that's making you lose weight? Exactly. You think you could take that fat burner and sit on your butt? I done took all kinds of fat burners. Sit on my butt, then lose a pound. That's before I knew that fat burners is not it. I'm not saying they don't help at all. I don't know if they help a little bit, but I'm just saying, though, you you sitting on your butt and then now you're moving. Think about that. You going to give all the credit to that fat burner? I took a fat burner and I'm all right. All right. I kind of messed that video up. I was supposed to put the equate after I put the other. I'm getting better at making videos, but I've been using my whiteboard to like timestamp which videos I put like the bench and then put all the pre-workout and the voice over this and do that talk about the equate pre-workout um but also I'm, I'm showing you this whiteboard because my son erased all my numbers that i needed man <laughs> but i've been using my whiteboard here and there you know so i'm gonna get really into whiteboard videos so i can break down things more you know what i'm saying i got a few videos i've been doing that on so stay tuned for the best fitness advice that you can possibly get Cause hey, us small YouTubers, just like um, a rapper or a singer or anything like that, or a basketball player, when they first start and they got something to prove, they gonna put their foot into it. So us small YouTubers, when it comes to fitness and everything else, hey man, I ain't I ain't saying nothing bad about the big YouTubers, even though I am kind of because the information don't be there. They talk about something, but they don't break nothing down. So that's coming, bro. Some of them do, but they be lying too. Using fake plates. You know what I'm saying? And they be juicing. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. They do. I'm kidding, but I'm dead serious. But comment, like, subscribe, share, holla back at your boy. Peace.
Oh, watch my video from yesterday too. Um, talking about STFU. That's the main thing you need to learn when you go to the gym. Shut up and put in the work. None of this stuff works if you don't work. None of it. Nothing. No, you can't just take something to sit down on your butt. Get up. Motivation. You know what I'm saying? You made it this far in the video and you ain't subscribed? What you waiting for, man? Come on, man. You know what I'm saying? You had to learn something to be this far. You know what I'm saying? Just do it, man. It's free. Now, I ain't going to beg, though. Do it. Or don't do it. Wait. No. Just, just do it. Dang.